Here are some amenity ideas to include in your vacation rental. So when people book a vacation rental property, they want an experience. And as much as they want to probably explore the area around them and leave the property to go do things, it's also really nice to have activities on the premises for families especially to enjoy with each other. Stats also show that rental properties with amenities get booked more often than ones that don't have them. Number one, a hot tub. A hot tub is a very excellent thing to add because it's not quite as expensive and involved as a pool. A hot tub is really going to to change the user's experience and really give something to look forward to as well as even making it something that they might even include in their itinerary. For example, let's say people have plans to go out one night but the weather isn't very good. They are going to remember themselves still having an amazing experience at your rental property versus focusing on the fact that the weather wasn't good and that they had to do other things. Like I mentioned, a hot tub is a little bit more on the expensive side but there's a lot of affordable options and it probably is something worthwhile to invest in. Of course, the photo opportunities are great and it's an excellent marketing tool as well. Next, a ping pong or a foosball table. So a ping pong table is rather large and if you don't have the space, I totally understand that. However, a foosball table is something that's a little bit like happy medium if you ask me. A foosball table is something small and compact that can sort of fit in various different spaces. It's also not too expensive and it definitely adds that added bonus, that extra fun feature and it's going to make lasting memories for your guests who are staying at your property. You can find a space for the foosball table inside the property, but another really cool idea, especially if you're in a warmer climate, is to put the table outside. While kids are playing in the backyard, while people are hanging out outside, maybe even barbecuing, you can get a really fun game going and it just adds that extra experience. Next, a fire pit. There is nothing like the beautiful ambiance of a fire pit, especially on a beautiful evening, with some nice lights outside, a fire pit is such a nice way to unwind, relax, and spend quality time with the people that you are vacationing with. It's also a rather inexpensive item to include. You can either make your own fire pit with rocks and wood, or you can just purchase one from places like Amazon or Home Depot and make it even easier for your customers to use. Plop a couple of chairs around it, add some string lights, and you have a perfect additional experience on your vacation rental property. Another great thing to include is swinging chairs. So you can either go all out and build a structure and hang the swings from the structure, but if you don't have the time, space, or the ability to do something like that, you can get swinging chairs that are already on stands. Depending on whatever works for you and your space, there's two great options when it comes to hanging chairs. Lots of people are really appreciating indoor-outdoor living, and a lot of people are opting to do full-blown kitchens outside in their backyard. Now, if you can't quite do something like that, Having a barbecue is great, but it's kind of almost expected at this point. A pizza oven, however, is a very unique and different experience while also not requiring you to spend too, too much money. And you can also use the pizza oven to cook other things. You could totally do meat in there as well, like you would on a barbecue, but you can also do fun desserts, different treats, appetizers, and then of course, pizza. It's a very fun activity to do with your family, and it's very easy for parents to set up a pizza station, cook them, and then everybody's eating and having fun. This last one sort of goes without saying, but it is absolutely vital to include a game station at your vacation rental property. Now, this doesn't mean you need an entire room dedicated towards games. However, even just a simple box bin or chest in the corner with a bunch of different games is just so necessary and it's such an easy thing for hosts to provide that extra fun and extra experience for your guests. Even if they're not planning to play games, if they're looking around your rental property, and they see a deck of cards, a Jenga game, and some other fun things like that, they're probably gonna be like, why not? Let's just play. And all of a sudden now you have them making memories and having fun experiences at your vacation rental property, which is going to prompt five-star reviews and referrals to their friends and family. You can even do it as simple as having three staple games like Jenga, Uno, and a deck of cards and call it a day. Last but not least, consider including one backyard game. Something like cornhole or lawn bowling is a really easy and simple thing to have on site and very, very fast for your guests to set up and play outside. Like I mentioned before, if you have a barbecue happening and kids, this gives them something extra to do rather than just run around the backyard and sort of play aimlessly with toys. It can also be turned into a fun, responsible adult drinking game 
if that type of thing floats your boat. Some of those games are as inexpensive as $25 and take up absolutely no storage space. There are some ideas for amenities for you guys to include in your next rental property. For more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel and come follow me on Instagram and TikTok for more.